Hey everybody, it's Party Elite welcoming you back to the Dawn of Man. We've had a pretty good recovery. We're up at a population of 30, a capacity of 33, so that means we should probably be upgrading one of our tents soon just to make sure that people are able to you know, move in still and, and we're not going to struggle with uh, <laughs> a population surplus. And we also have finally reached the Copper Age, which means we are developing a little copper processing area over here where we're going to try and keep things super efficient now it was actually pointed out to me that might have been a good idea to get the metalsmith actually working over here instead because then they'd be right next to the storage facilities they'd be able to um deliver things right away i'm not exactly i'm not exactly sure that might be a good idea but the thinking over here with uh, putting the metalsmith over here is we've got trees that we can chop down and put into the wood pile from the wood pile, we can go to the charcoal pit and make charcoal, and the charcoal then goes to the rock pile alongside copper. So we've got charcoal and copper, uh, and then that could be taken to the pit furnace to make it into copper ore, or not copper ore, but to make it into, oh god. Okay, bears down. <laughs> Jesus, that came out of nowhere. These animal attacks are getting very frequent. Um... But yeah, so then that could be made, uh, so the copper ore and the charcoal would turn into copper over here, and then, like, it either sits over here, and we wait, and then it gets dragged all the way back, or it gets completed, and then it gets dragged all the way back. I'm, I'm very torn, and I'm wondering, maybe I do two metalsmiths. One over here for, like, you know, a, a quicker production, and then one over here to supplement the production, so that it does, all those tools do get stored in the storage huts over here. I don't know. Stuff to think about. What I do need out here, though, and it was rightfully pointed out, but I was planning on doing it after all these get completed. Um, what I need here is at least one home so someone can, you know, tuck into. We need a hearth or a hearth, I suppose is how it's pronounced. Um, and we need a well. That way we'll have access to, you know, a little bit of food, um, some water, things like that with easy access. Because otherwise, whoever's out here is going to be very upset. We might even give them a totem or a skull pole that they can use, like the skull, the closest skull pole is over here, which isn't all that far away, but we might want to keep them a little bit happier. Uh, is there another one? Yeah, so, we'll see. We'll see, we'll see. Right now, this is all being constructed. I'm not going to move the metal smiths just yet. Something to think about, though. And, um, it was pointed out, actually, that the rock pile... Yeah, the rock pile does not have space for mud. It was mentioned in the comments, I just wanted to check, but no, that's, that's not the case. Mud gets stored in storage huts, and we don't have enough mud. We need to collect more mud faster. We also need to get this stable done. One straw is all we need, so we're waiting until the harvest season, so... Or until a trader arrives, and then we just need to get the straw off of him. That'll be fine. Go ahead and get rid of all this. Uh, the temperatures should be fine right now. 27 degrees Celsius. Man, I hate reporting on Toronto weather every time I play, but I see those numbers, and right now, in Toronto, it feels like negative 20 degrees Celsius. Terrible. And it was a struggle getting out of bed in the morning. It's terrible. Anyways, let's speed time up here. We've got uh, this bear. Oh my god, these bears. These bears are nonstop. No, why, why are you chasing after it? Let this thing leave. No, I said let it leave. No, don't go after the bear. All the way back. There we go. I don't, I don't need to pick fights. I guess we've encroached in their territory. In fact, there is a knowledge point to be had, I think, if I get a couple more bears... Uh, let's see. Bear. Yeah, two, literally a couple more bears and I'll be fine there. Yeah, we should do a little bit more hunting, I suppose. No reason not to. I could build some more wells as well. You know what? Let's go ahead and get this well on the way. Uh, where are we? Production. Oh, I should probably get a workshop down as well. Forgot that I unlocked the workshop. Anyway, for now, let's stay focused. So we've got ourselves a well over... Put you down over here. Let's get another well down over here somewhere, I'm thinking. We've got one around these houses. And I could put another one down around all this storage space. Or we've got another one next to the animals. Hmm. Put. Yeah, sure. We, we, could put, we could put one down over here. Sure, let's do that. Very close to this, but again, kind of working towards the knowledge point. But also trying to get ourselves some more coverage now that we have more you know, resources and, and time and people to, to spend. 
man. I need to... This thing needs to get finished. I should have waited. I'm gonna need straw. I shouldn't have ordered the upgrade. Alright, well, let's make it to fall. Make it to the harvest season. Alright, this is getting completed over here finally. Good stuff. And I could get copper sickles and copper picks. Because copper spears are two and two for hunting and fighting. Whereas bone spears are the same. So I might as well just keep bone spears happening. You know, save the copper. Trying to find a balance between using all my resources the right way. Alright, trees are going down over here. Go ahead and cut these two trees down as well, I think. Clear some space out so we can extend our farms. I don't think I need to just yet. But pretty soon we're, we're going to need to. Pretty soon. I'm wondering, because we're not low on food by any means, so I don't need the, uh, the, I, I don't need pulses yet, except for, for knowledge points, actually. You know what? Let's go ahead and do it. Go ahead and do it. Let's get some peas. And let's get some chickpeas. Ooh, lentils. I like lentils. I like chickpeas, too. There we go. I'm just using my own dietary preferences to decide what we plant. Cool, so we'll clear out some of these trees and then we'll put down some more fields. And what's this? We got another boar up over here. Can we hunt that boar down? Got a couple hunters here, but they're all pretty tired and hungry and stuff. So let's not, let's not uh, keep them too busy. They've already got enough to do. No need for more. Uh, it was also asked in the comments why I'd want to keep this many goats. I could get rid of some of the goats. Actually, we have quite a few, but goats give us milk. Uh, and when they get old and we butcher them at their at their limit, they give us um, meat and hide and stuff like that. Meat and skin, I should say specifically. But um, that milk is helpful because it helps us with knowledge. I believe it also acts as, it counts as food. So I don't want to reduce them. Pigs, they only provide us with uh, food and meat and, and bone as well when you kill an animal. Um, but I believe they give a pretty good return on investment basically so i don't want to kill too many of them off and then sheep give us wool and with wool we can make wool cloth and with wool cloth you can make wool uh clothes well outfits rather sorry so uh that's why all these animals are useful uh donkeys eventually will become useful when we can get our uh you know donkey domestication and the wheel because then we can get the cart going so that's our focus i'm going to leave megalithism behind not in a rush to get there our people are pretty happy but, uh, yeah, our, our focus next is going to be the wheel, well, donkey domestication and then the wheel. I think that's a bit more urgent. Yeah, this, uh, stable space is getting annoying. I'm aware. We're working on it. I just need to get to fall. We just need the straw, and then we'll make it, we'll make it happen. We'll make it happen. All right, and I want to see... This is dangerous grounds. Uh, I need to put a fort down over here. I need to put down, like, a little wall section... And then put down some towers so that when the raiders come, if the raiders come, I should say, and attack us here, uh, it won't be the end of the world. You need to be very wary of that. Just got some wool outfits over here. Just just like that laying down over there. Alright. It's well done. I'm just trying to figure out if I want to put a hut down there. If I put a house down there, then it's more likely to get attacked. It seems like raiders don't care about uh, production spaces. They care about attacking animals, and they care about attacking. Um, they care about attacking animals, and they care about attacking housing. That seems to be the case. All right, this. Uh, do we have more mud coming in? We've got a decent amount of mud, actually. No, we don't. We don't. We don't need to do. Ooh, do we need to hunt some reindeer? No, I'm trying to keep people from being too busy. Fall is coming as well, so we won't have time to. Harvest the animals and stuff. Alright. Overall, things are pretty well. I'm glad that lake is still being used as a bit of a watering hole, because otherwise we'd be in trouble. Otherwise we'd be in trouble. Okay, well, if you're going to come this close... Oh, we just have the one hunter over here. One up there. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. Reindeer. Oh, I need to kill a lot more. And you know what? It's harvest season. Let it be. Let them roam freely. Unless I have a lot of hunters nearby. Yeah, let them roam freely. Are they going to come inside? Yeah, let them roam freely. <laughs> I don't need to kill everything. All right. How are we doing up over here? I do wish there was like a little mini map that I could use to move a little bit more easily. Already seen that. What's the difference between resources... 
and group resources. Oh, okay, I see they're categorized. Food, I guess raw material, or tools, clothes. I don't mind this layout, actually. It's a lot easier to read, but I don't need it. Yeah, we're okay. We're okay. Alright, let's get to the harvest now. We've got enough sickles. We've got 15 sickles. We're trying to make more sickles. We have more coming there. Got more coming here. I should probably make... Yeah, we've got bone spears coming and stuff. Got bows coming. Yeah, we're fine. And this mine still has plenty to give. We're still moving all the way across over to here. Probably will want a hut. I'll probably want to build the defensive capabilities here first. That's a lot of charcoal pits. I should not have wasted... I could probably get rid of this one. Okay, at least we're getting the uh, pit furnace done. Alright, good stuff. Good stuff, good stuff. Yeah, I should, I should really speed time up more often. It helps. There's another knowledge point from the pit furnace. We might need another stable, like, right away. Oh my god, we do. Let's go ahead and build. Yet another stable. These are a lot of animals. Uh, okay, this is a little annoying. Not the end of the world, but it is a little annoying. I'm going to have to put it down over here. Hopefully that tree isn't, like, in my way. I mean, hopefully once I cut it down, we'll have space is what I meant to say. Literally, not at all what I said, but now you know. We're going to cut that tree down see what we can do there. And then back over here. This wood pile is filling up real fast. Rock pile, not so quickly. But it's okay. Once all this stuff starts being produced, we'll be okay. And let's see. Well, first things first, I'm going to build some more watchtowers back over here. We've got this side protected. Um, we're going to get this side protected. Oh, we need to finish the walls over here. Come on, guys. Come on. Get, uh... This is probably a useful spot for a watchtower. The asymmetry is going to kill me, but it's probably not, not a good spot for a watchtower. There, let's do... That. And leave that gap for now. Alright, good stuff. Get all those orders out. Workload is too high and stuff, that's fine. You gotta work hard to play hard. It's that simple. Gone over our population capacity, but I believe our hut is going to be completed soon. Or it's just gonna sit here. Let's set it to high priority. We've got the sticks, we've got the logs, we've got the straw, and we've got the mud. We've got everything we need. This shouldn't be taking that long. And do we actually have enough sledges? 14 sledges for 14 plus another 7, 21. You know what? We could make more sledges. Go ahead and make some more sledges. And I'd like to maybe get donkey domestication so we can start collecting donkeys. So that when it's time to uh, get the wheel and start building carts, we already have some donkeys. So, donkey domestication. Let's keep our eyes out for donkeys. Hopefully they venture close enough. I know they've, they've come pretty close in the past, but hopefully they keep coming close. Yeah, not going to go too far away. Not going to go too far away. <laughs> Alright. Oh, yeah, we need another stable right away. I mean, I guess I could put it down over here. Can I find someone with an axe right away? We got an axe. Go. Don't get sticks. Yeah, let's get that taken care of right away. You're bringing charcoal from where? Are you seriously coming from all the way up here to bring charcoal down there? But I want charcoal stored over here. Alright, let's go to this rock pile over here. And do that. 
just to make sure they don't store it here. This load might get dropped down over here. Ah, no. Okay, good. She's turning right around right away. Good. Good. We're going to cut this tree down. Hopefully, that'll make enough space for our uh, stable. Clearly, we need it right away. This harvest is nowhere near complete. But again, food isn't really my primary concern. It's more the straw that I'm worried about. We'll see how much more gets done. Because we spent a decent amount of time building. I guess it's a pretty short harvest season in this world. In this uh, area. Let's go ahead and set this to a high priority as well. See how much we can get done. This has been completed, so let's go ahead and build another stable. Ah, yes, there we go. Excellent. Not perfect. Better than what it was before. Yeah, we definitely need some more straw. We're not going to make it to this harvest. Like, we're not going to be able to harvest the einkorn. Fair enough. Not the end of the world. Not the end of the world. We've got 18 straw to make it all the way to the end. Hmm. A little worrying. Because we're building... We've got this hut that doesn't need any more straw, but this stable needs four. These watchtowers... You know what? Cancel the watchtowers. We've done fine without them so far, and I'm going to take a horrible risk. Let's get the stables done. Because, yeah, Jesus, these animals. I believe I've set a limit for my goats, so we should be culling them right now. Yeah, 15. Actually, you know what? Let's keep the donkeys. Oh, is that a raider attack? Yes, it is. All right, alert. Slowly approaching. Get everybody to these gates, please. And let's close all the gates. All right, we've got people on these towers. Hopefully we're gonna get some work done nice and early. Come on now. Gun him down. Metaphorically gun him down. I'm surprised they're actually attacking in the winter. I wouldn't have suspected that at all. Can we please? Alright. This poor, poor old man is stuck outside. That's right. 1v1 him. Oh, this is not good. Dare you kill my dogs. And we've got a blizzard coming in? Oh my god. I believe that's it. Yes, that is it. Alright, everyone. Back indoors. Back inside. This is a horrible time to be outside. Attacked by man and... Uh, and the world alike. Let's go ahead and set our uh, gate to be built. Can't have that hole for too long. The watchtower has definitely helped. Oh, we, 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 we don't have enough straw. Next season, we need to get a lot. We need to make sure we actually finish all of this uh, farming. And I think we actually would want more, like, barley and stuff to make sure we get more... more straw. Cut you down. Yeah, let's clear the space out. Put down some more fields. I mean, when the weather's nice. Right now, everyone should be returning home. Don't drink water in this weather. Just go home. Hold on to your thirst. <laughs> Negative 14. And a trader decides to arrive in this weather. Fair enough. No hook has died of hypothermia. No reason to have done that. You're at home. You could have gone inside. We've got warm clothes. For everybody. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. Alright. I do not need goats. Uh, I need some straw. I'm wondering if I should get some bows. And then in turn, I can give you... What could I give you? No, keep your bows. 
I just need your straw. And I need to start hunting more. I need dry skin to make bows. I keep forgetting that. Nothing else I really need over here. The copper ore can wait. We're fine. Okay. Whatever, whatever helps me get a little bit further. Oh, speed time up. No, no need watching this uh, slow blizzard. Why are you still going out to work? What is winter domestication? Oh, all the animals, I guess. More than enough animals in this... Uh, uh, there, there are more animals than humans in this world of ours. Oh, I should have just canceled that construction, damn it. Got the knowledge point, though, so there's that. Another death from hypothermia? Come on, guys. We're... I mean, I understand we were at population capacity, but that means everyone's got a place to go. People should not have died of hypothermia. Oof. A lot of dead goats. And... I mean, what am I supposed to do about that? People were home. They could have gone into their huts. Uh, we've got the hearths, or the hearths, or however you wish to pronounce it. And then we've got, um... Warm clothes. I mean, I'm getting more wool outfits done, but... Jeez. What am I supposed to do about the animals? And I guess... Uh, I guess the animals are fair, because we couldn't get that last stable done in time. And those blizzards are a lot more deadly than, um... Those lizards are a lot more deadly than the storms were in uh, in the other playthrough. All right, so we're getting some work done over here. Let's see how this works. We have no straw. Yeah, this is not a good situation. We should have got a lot more straw. Now, the thing is, can we? Oh, great! We've already lost track of the animal. Like, can we at least harvest the resources off of these animals? It's not just a waste. That's the other thing. We'll have enough food for our people. Maybe, maybe we should go out on a hunt just to get some more... Just to get some more skins and stuff. Or maybe we should wait until this is done first. We do not have the straw. Okay, fair enough. We don't have the straw, so there's no point waiting couple people out here who are willing to hunt. Cool. Go ahead and get you guys hunting. Let's go. This winter's going to be a harsh one. But once we clear this stuff out, I need to make sure I plant more, um... More straw sources. And well, the sheep are coming back real strong. Alright, here we go. You all have spears... And one set of bow and arrow. Alright, cool. Okay, nice. Go ahead and take care of that right away. And let's go ahead and get at least one of these kids. Imagine domesticating bears. It's like, why can't we? Why can't we change history? Alright. This is all fine. Is somebody harvesting this? I thought somebody was harvesting this. I'm just going to leave it to the people. You do you. Somebody is harvesting that. There we go. Why can't we feed our animals other stuff? Like, uh, like meat. I understand they're herbivores, but you know, when you're hungry, you're hungry. And pigs, I mean, pigs will eat anything, right? I wonder if the game actually takes that into consideration. Like, pigs are less likely to starve to death and stuff like that. Okay, I'm not going to chase him for too much longer here. Turn around. More people dying of hypothermia. It's just because I have access to wool outfits now, so the game expects wool outfits as a baseline. That one's going to get away. Cool. Alright, done. I'm done with that hunt. I need to stop getting distracted. I need to stop getting distracted. Okay, nothing over here is going to get done, unfortunately. We are working up over here. I will need... Okay, let's go ahead and build a... Uh, I keep forgetting it's under production. 
Put it down over here. And I, I, I wonder if I should put in a storage tent. Just so that we have a space for food. But I don't think food will be transported up there. Do these up so the raw skin gets uh, converted. Because again, I would like to get some more bows happening. Now, right, speed time up. Workload is constantly too high again in that space right now. I could actually recycle the watchtowers. Ah, speak of the devil, we were just talking about pigs dying of starvation. Recycle the watchtowers and put them more in a more central position? I could do. Could do. Keep it for now. Winter is almost at an end, so at least at least only one animal has died of starvation. Hopefully everyone will scatter and eat. Ah, nope, there is a second animal dying of starvation. Fair enough. What was the water symbol for? I guess we must have reached a knowledge milestone. These goats are dying. All right, time for food. Food aplenty. And I need to plant more as well. All right, uh, let's see. I have no time to waste. Go ahead and get some barley down. Mountainside farming. This is annoying. That little one empty spot there, really annoying. I could do... Nope, can't do that. Sure, let's do that. At least there's room over here. Set that to a priority as well. Everybody. Everybody to the fields. I wonder if that'll be enough. Because last time we didn't even get a complete harvest in. So that's another thing altogether. Speed this up. And at least plant. Come on, surely there's some kids. Okay, good, good. We're over here. Alright, we've got... Uh... This kid doing nothing, going to hut. No, you don't need to do that. You need to get to the field. What are you doing? You're hungry? Okay, fine. If you're hungry, you're hungry. That's fine. If you're like that hungry, you're hungry. Otherwise, it doesn't count. You're tired? That's that's a pathetic excuse. A pathetic excuse. We're carrying back bone and stuff from the hunts down here. Looks like we're almost done with that. You're going out to get all this meat. All right, fair enough. Fair enough. This thing is going to need repairing. Great. Soon. But we have the materials for it, so that's fine. Alright, good. The kids work in the field. We have more children. We do. You there. No more sticks. We don't need more sticks. I should reduce how many sticks we collect. Where's our stick collecting? Take it down to 20. We don't need a constant supply of 56 anymore. We're past that era. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs> I hope we're past that era. Alright, over here, this is still not being built. We need stone. We've got stone. We need sticks. I mean, we should be able to bring sticks over. We've got plenty. And I wonder if... Okay, we've got one copper sickle done. Gotta figure... I, I, I figure I need to put a house down, but I don't want to put a house down until I can put down some, like, watchtowers and stuff, because otherwise the house will be attacked. Just pacing myself here. Besides, we're too busy right now, anyway. Dealing with all this. I feel like people aren't treating this as enough of a priority. <laughs> and what's our welfare like? It's probably pretty low, 70%. Yeah. Now, if the wool... We've got enough wool to make enough wool cloth. We also have enough wool cloth. 10 wool cloth times 2 is... 20. Which is... 36 wool outfits. That we can make. If somebody just makes them. Now, workload is too high right now because of the... Uh, planting... Wow, we actually didn't get a proper... Oof. The shift in season lengths is... I'm not going to call it a problem, but it does make a difference. You notice it the more you farm. You notice how the length of the season is quite different. And plenty of pigs and stuff.
Sledge is no longer usable. Hopefully, I won't be using sledges for much longer. And again, let's keep our eyes out for donkeys. I haven't seen one in a long time, actually. I haven't seen one in quite some time. Oh, hello. Speak of the devil. Ah, uh, these are... Oh, no, there we go. We've got some younglings. Capture these two. Gotta get a, gotta get a start on those uh, carts and stuff. I need to consistently remind myself to stop giving people orders. Oh, they're going to keep falling behind on the stuff that needs doing. On, like, one thing or another that needs doing. And people are going to keep dying of, like, hypothermia and stuff. I need to check myself before I wreck myself is what I'm saying, basically. Not enough stable space. I'm aware of that. Gotta wait until the fall. Get all the straw we need. And we'll be okay. Where are you going with that? Why are you collecting water over here? Come on. Let's see what these guys do here. You got a log. And you're going to take that log where? I wish I could set up like... Zone of supplies or something like that. Like are we really out of logs here? We are. Alright, so that means we got to cut more trees over here. So, let's... Not plenty of logs here. I want to keep cutting some of these trees down. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to set this up to 20. And we're going to put down our tree cutting space. Okay, well, we are cutting these trees. Alright, good. That's all I ask. That's all I ask. Think local, act global. Or, no, act local, think global. Think global, act local. Whichever one it is. You guys know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. Alright, it is harvest season, so let's go ahead and get ourselves some, you know, chickpeas and peas and stuff. Again, just helping with the knowledge points. Not going to set it as a priority because the food isn't really my concern. We've got other things we need to worry about. And yeah, we didn't even get to plant a proper... Because we've got so much other stuff going on, but we haven't been able to plant everything we needed. Some more space has been cleared out to put down some more fields. Not that I'll be able to tend to them with the population I have right now. I think what I need to do... I think what I need to do is... Uh, Set my limits to 10. Just for now. Less to feed. It's a bit more sustainable. Just for now. Eventually we'll have, you know, more animals and people, sure. Eventually. But right now, not really working out for me. Alright, we're okay. We didn't manage to catch those donkeys, and you are giving chase, though. You are giving chase, hungry as you are. You're just gonna sit down and drink some milk, it looks like? Yeah, that milk disappeared. Well, I'm, I'm glad you were carrying that with you. Where'd that donkey go? There it is. Maybe it'll make its way back. Workload is still too high. Got anything else produced here? This might not be working out as I had hoped it would. I might need to put... I mean, I know I need to put a house down. I know I need to put a house down. Just don't want to do it until I have the resources to put a watchtower down as well. For that, we got to wait until fall. Again, hopefully we're going to get a decent harvest. You know what? This can be a normal priority. All this needs to be high priority. The flax. We've got seven linen. One linen cloth. That's eight linen cloth. Sixteen plus twenty is thirty-six. So we've got enough linen to make enough linen clothes, like outfits. I'm not too concerned about that. Do we have enough sickles back here? I got sixteen sickles. I want everybody tending to the fields right now. Okay, we're working on it. We got a trader coming through. See if she has any straw or anything. And you don't. You have linen, though. Oh, wait, you do have straw. I'm blind. Don't think I'm in a position to trade in for donkeys.
as much as I'd like to. You know what? We just captured a couple of our own. Don't think I need to. We'll give you... We'll give you some... We'll give you a wooden harpoon. And then we'll give you... Actually, you know what? Here, have a sling. And I'll take a bread off you. Sure. A fair trade. I think. I would love if everybody would just... End the fields. Okay. You're going to the field. You're going to get a sickle. One of the stables. Alright, some straw, I guess. No, you know what? Not now. Work. Work the fields first. Going to Einkorn. Alright, cool. I think some of them are working. I guess you can cut down. I guess you can harvest with a flint axe. Or I guess you're using the uh, biface. Yeah, for harvesting. Okay. It just takes longer, I assume. Look at that. We're halfway through the season already, and we've barely... Oh, man. Wow, the biface takes a long time to harvest with. We need... I guess I could make more sickles. Come on, folks. I understand that you're, like, hungry and stuff, but... There's much more important stuff that needs doing right now. You do not need to get straw. Soon there won't be straw. Yep, to go into the totem. No, no, no. Work the fields, damn it. Work the fields. Alright. We need more sickles. Going to the tent. I don't think so. I think you're coming up over here instead. You, where are you going? Going to barley. Okay, good. Very little time left in this harvest. At least we got 15 straw. We got a lot of grain out of it. A decent bit of straw out of it. Jeez. Still not a complete harvest. I would consider it a complete harvest if we planted a full, like, set of fields and we also harvested everything. But, hey, you know what? That... It's not as bad as it was earlier. This is the last piece that's left. We're just about to get to it, maybe. Ah, we didn't get to that. Okay. 24 straw. Is that enough? Is that enough? Do we go another season without any watchtowers? It's starting to feel like it. It's starting to feel like it. Might not be a bad idea. Because a watchtower takes how much to build? Two straw. Yeah, I guess we could put two down. J just because they are very helpful. And it's like, who am I storing straw for if everyone's dead? So let's go ahead and get those watchtowers down. That'll take us down to 20. All right, that, that should be fine. And down over here, again, I don't know if this is working for me. I could put down just a tent. As opposed to a hut. Save ourselves the straw. Just use some skins. We'll leave the defenses for later. Where do I want to put this? Is the other question. Guess I can put you down like here. Sure. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's see what's going on over here. What are you carrying back? Water. You're coming all the way here for water. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. At least we're slaughtering animals and getting resources off of them. Yeah. Good raw skin coming through. Lots of stuff coming through. We're making more bone equipment. New humans are joining the settlement. Excellent. Good stuff. We've got donkeys. Um, I could start building carts, actually. Do carts need straw? I don't think so. I wish I could see what a cart needed. 
Okay. Let's go ahead and research the wheel. Change the world. And let's build ourselves some carts. Four carts for two donkeys. That seems to make sense to me. Yep, the math definitely adds up. And we do have the resources. Just, okay, we're, we're down on the leather, actually. Down on the leather. So maybe we go on a little hunt. Maybe we go on a little hunt. When our domesticated animals are providing, but not nearly as much as I need to. Need them to, I mean. You, you're carrying flour all the way up here. Why? Why? You want to eat flour underground? No. No, you're baking bread over here. Okay. Right, because we don't have flour over here. And you're collecting water from over here. Okay. We've got plenty of good wells over here. But no, you got to go to that one. I just don't... That kind of stuff blows my mind. It's like, what am I supposed to do about that? I mean, was that child up in the mountains for some reason and then decides to go that way? Maybe. I suppose. We do have some donkeys over here. Pretty far away. See if we can't get them. Because again, we want them reproducing. Right? We want them... Making babies so we can have more. Okay, well, we're working here. That's good. Oh, see, where is copper stored? Copper itself is stored all the way back over there. I'm guessing. Okay, let's keep our eyes on this guy. Let's see what he does with this copper, right? Because we've got one over here. Does he just go back and forth? Because that would make sense. That would be ideal. We're almost out of straw already. No. He goes all the way back to the storage hut to store the copper. Alright. Okay. So the game really needs to allow you to decide what goes into a storage hut. Or a storage tent. Which is what we're going to put down over here. If I can find a place for it to exist. Go ahead and put you... Over here. Man. Alright. Alright. Good to know. No, we are already out of straw. Animals, man. They eat fast. Eat very fast. We're going to lose a lot of animals this winter. Just to starvation. I'm trying to figure out what... Let's go ahead and put some more fields down over here. More barley. Okay, let's do that. And let's get some more einkorn in there, if I can fit some up here. Hmm. Of course, that slope is too steep. Find a nice little cozy spot. I guess we'll do this two by two. The harsh slopes are really unfortunate. I might be able to fit another field over here if I chop these trees down. We're going to try it. And the workload is too high. How's the workload too high? Do we get rid of the fishing? Maybe we get rid of the fishing. Stop fishing. We got enough bread. We got enough meat. We should be fine. We're also chasing after these donkeys over here. And they're really far away. I don't know who's going that way, but... Someone is. We got a lot of people roaming around here as well. Hopefully some of this stuff gets constructed soon. Alright. 
feel like I need to slow things down a little bit. Like I'm rushing things and it's just causing us so much struggle. Is done. Don't have the straw. Gotta wait until next fall. That's so far away. That's so far away. We really have to focus on um I'm guessing we scared them off over there. But I, yeah, I really have to focus on the harvest. You're having a drink. Young male over here. That one's mine, I guess. It's making its way home. You all look like adults over here. Well, we managed to get five donkeys. They'll, they'll find their way home. They'll find their way home. Let's speed time up. Don't need to watch my animals starve to death. At least we're culling them and keeping them in check. We got these hearts being built up here as well. That'll hopefully help. We've got enough tannin to make some more raw skin, so please let's get on that. There we go. I speak of the devil, and it happens. Alright. Alright, people. A goat has died. Of star Two goats have died of starvation. Sheep's been slaughtered. We're, we're okay. It's not the end of the world. We'll, we'll sort it out. We'll sort it out. I'm trying to find that happy balance right now. I am happy we decided to call our animal population a little bit, because it was getting way out of hand. Tent is going to get built soon. Storage tent. Hmm. Some time to go there still. Animals dying of starvation. Still have plenty. Of animals, I mean. <laughs> not of straw. Definitely not of straw. What is that? Oh, okay. Construction sites all the way off in the distance. Highlighting like walls. On which note, these walls have finally been completed. Excellent. A lot of repair work to be done. Survive the winter. Okay. Let's go. You're a high priority. You're a high priority. And you're a high priority. Everybody. On the fields. Down here. Gonna get everybody on these fields. No time to waste. It's fun seeing the animals uh, flow out like that. Let's go. No, no time. You coming back? What are you carrying? Wanna get a log? Nah. You're heading out. You're all heading out. Yeah. Yeah, you're heading out. You. Cool. You. Going to fur. For what purpose? No good reason. That was a betting man. Okay, this guy's actually pretty hungry. He's an old man too. He's actually pretty hungry. So let's let him go eat. What are you doing? You can plant seeds while carrying mud. Don't give me these excuses. Gotta work hard to survive. Where are you going? Not working hard. You don't work hard, you don't survive. Where are you going? Tent? A rest for the wicked. Dry fish? No. Ooh, our donkeys. Run free. <laughs> Run free, donkeys. Run free. No time for prayer. No time for bows. Let's go. Yeah, getting a little micromanagey over here, but you know what? Evidently our people want to die otherwise. Drinking water? You think that's going to help you survive? I'm joking. I'm very well aware that you die sooner out of dehydration than out of starvation. But still. Come on, child. <laughs> you don't know this. Yeah. Feel like we're doing a decent job this year? Feel like we're staying on top of things? I'm going to get tannin. Sure, you know what? I, I could use some tannin, I suppose. Oh, I have a lot of tannin. Alright. You're lucky, kid. These fields have been tended to. You're lucky. You can go get tannin instead. 
As long as you're doing some kind of work, I suppose. And are these getting completed? Soon. We just need a lot of leather. So maybe we do a little hunting after. After the fields have been tended to, I mean. Are some animals down here that we could chase after? There's some deer. You're unhappy, eh? Maybe a hunt will make you happy. A little bit of hard work right now, and they'll be they'll be happy for it later. All three of you. Got a wolf over here we can hunt. That shouldn't be very difficult. Down you go, and over here. Let's get the deer. Come on now, hurry it up. Pick up the pace. I'm trying to get the skin. I need the skins for a variety of things. Our flow of skins have reduced, has reduced significantly ever since we um, domesticated animals. All right, not the end of the world. Here we go. Down over here. Got a trader as well, so I'll check in on that trader soon. Nice. Come on. Down you go. Right, lots of harvesting to do. We could chase after you as well, but these people are really unhappy. Let's get that one off. Get you. Get you. Alright, come on. There's got to be a lot over here. There's a cave line coming through. Not on my watch. You're a little sleepy, but let's go ahead and take care of this cave line before it eats all of our hunt. There we go. Now, hopefully people will go ahead and harvest all of that. Trader, what do you bring me? You bring me straw. I need straw. You bring me clothes. I don't need clothes that badly, but... Empty, isn't it? Empty. I'll stick with the straw. Just the straw, and you can take some wooden harpoons. And some bifaces. Sure. Go ahead and do that. Go ahead and do that. And over here, what's the situation? The tent has been built. Storage tent is being built. Yeah, see, the charcoal is having to go, for some reason, rather than being stored on the rock pile, the charcoal is coming from our storage tent all the way over here. That just does not make sense. Love to understand where that prioritization is coming from. Love to understand where that's coming from. Alright, but that should be a lot of raw skin coming through, as long as people prioritize these harvests. I'm going to keep an eye on them. Yeah, okay, somebody's coming out here. Gotta keep coming. Yeah, all right, there we go. We got old lady up over here. Yeah, there we go. Raw skins being collected. I miss those giant mammoth hunts. Those were really helpful. Those were really helpful. We were we had so much meat and so much. Oh, we had so much. Everything was plentiful. Okay, we got some decent harvests going on. Oh, there's some decent hunting to do over here as well. But I think all of our hunters are probably pretty pooped. Workload is too... You know what? Let's leave it be. Most people are idling, and it doesn't look like anybody's idling. A lot of repair work to be done that can't be done. We don't have the straw and stuff. Got the skins. You know what? Yeah, let's leave some time so that the raw skin can be converted into leather. And, uh... And we can get these carts done. Because, again, that'll save us a lot of time. Save us a lot of time. Uh, I don't know if we were able to harvest everything, actually. Okay. I yeah, got a decent bit of skin out of it. Decent bit of skin out of it. Got these animals over here. See, in theory, this should work pretty effectively once this uh, storage tent has been completed. In theory. Go ahead and make... Go 
there. But we don't need... Can't cancel them. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Fair enough. A little bit of extra won't kill me. A little bit of extra won't kill me. Yeah, see, I don't care so much about the flax not being planted. Because, again, we have... We've got a, more than enough linen and stuff. Uh, enough linen outfits. Next season, it'll probably actually have to be priority as some of these clothes get worn out. Oh, I was a goat being slaughtered. I was like, what the hell was that noise? Or goat. But yeah, next season, we'll probably need the flax, but I think we're okay. We just need to make sure we harvest everything here. Good, some new humans have joined us. Capacity of 37. Oh, right, because we finished the little tent up over here. I'll take it. <laughs> I'll take it. A human was born as well. Oh, wolf attack. Well, that was fast. Killed him before the dogs even made it. Those are two wolves attacking us. Well, hey. Lots of skin and stuff to be had right close to home. Sometimes I don't mind the animal attacks, you know? There's another one. These are pigs. Or are pigs. Well, they're traveling way too far for me to do anything about it. We're going to lose one. At least this one will survive. Damn, man, that's sad. <laughs> Nature at work here. Nature at work. Alright, so this cart's being used finally. That should hopefully help. Alright, harvest time. Don't rush this harvest. Okay, I think we're... Workload is too high. Well, you just gotta work harder, buddy. Work hard, and then the workload will be lower. That That's it. It's a very simple logic. Work hard now. It'll be easier later. Skull pole. Going to pray. There's no time to pray right now. You. Get back out here. Tend to the fields. We desperately need... All of this straw. Like, desperately. Want barley. Anybody else out here who's just lazing about? Bunch of children. Useless children. Come on, Balak. What are you doing? What are you doing, man? I don't care if you're going to farm with bar with uh, with a biface. Building a cart? No. Nah. No need for a cart if you can't transport anything. Going to sledge? Nah. What else have we got? Nothing else back here, really. Yeah, nobody else back here, I mean, rather. We're good. Focus on the fields. Ooh, what are you up to? Going to get a sledge? Nah. Alright. My eye on these people. These lazy, lazy people. again i just need these guys i just need the adults to harvest so that the kids can then bring the stuff back home don't don't get berries just an old lady wanted to pick berries it's just like no that's not how the world works i'm gonna get pulses all right now where are you getting barley from Okay, you're at the farm. All right, okay. This is going okay. Back over here. Spot someone not tending to the fields, and it's like, nope. To the field with you. Just because the season is that short. Okay. Over here. What are you doing? I'm going to get straw. Nope. Rain. Nope. Sorry, guys. I know this might be very painful and slow, but need to make sure all gets tended to. There. That should be good. 
What are you up to? Going to the skull pole. Okay, I think we're doing all right. It's everybody that's like harvesting with a biface is slowing everything down. But I can't actually tell people to go get sickles. They just kind of do that as they wish. All right. A decent harvest, it looks like. Looks like. I'm going to get pulses. You're fine. Stop your complaining. Then stop your complaining. Stop. Stop. Stop your... Okay, she's just ignoring me now. That's fine. I, I guess I can't blame her. I kind of pushed her to the edge. People are getting exhausted. You know what? Maybe we leave things a little bit for now. We did pretty well this season, at least. We did pretty well. You're fine. You can still go to the fields. Okay. Same goes for you. Okay, there we go. We're losing a lot of our sledges, so I'm going to have to make uh, a lot of sledges as well. Alright. An infinitely better harvest season here. 52 straw. We've got our animal population in check. Not that many goats, but... What are you going to do? Don't go to get the sledge. Go to... Oh, looks like we have tended to all these fields. Yeah, excellent. Okay, good stuff. Good stuff. Now, these fields are just, you know, extra. They'll be happy soon enough. They'll be happy soon enough. Is someone tending to this? I mean, yes, this is a depressing time period. Everyone's unhappy over here. Our uh, welfare must be excessively low. But listen, <laughs> it's for the greater good, okay? It's for the greater good just in time. You know what? Uh, we don't even need to... I don't even I don't even want to bother with those pulses. I don't even want to bother with those pulses. But with 54 straw, 47 grain, we don't even need that much grain. But it's more about the straw. We finished all the construction over here. We need to get all this repair work done. Seems like it has been done, so that's nice and helpful. Population capacity of 37 is not good enough. We're going to want to build at least one more hut. Get you down. Let's get you down over here. Go ahead and do that. Don't want to block a path necessarily. Sure, let's, get, let's, let's do that. All right, so we need to get that down because we want to make sure we can get up to 40 soon. Um, we need to make some more sledges. Yeah, we need to make a lot more sledges, actually. But for that, we need a lot more leather and stuff. We don't have enough tannin, unfortunately. But we'll sort that out when the next season comes through. And then meanwhile, we'll do some uh, winter hunting to get some more skin that we can use. Uh, if there are any happy hunters... Nah, all the hunters have been... I've also been taking care of the fields, I think. Got a couple people down here. Yeah, I could send a couple people out to do a little bit of hunting. We're low on food, eh? I don't think we need nearly that many people for this hunt. Where are you off to? Yeah, you guys are a little tired, so you can stay over here. Oh, crap. The raider attack? Are you serious right now? All right, let's hit the alert. At least we've got the straw and stuff necessary to... At least it isn't during, like, the harvest season. There's some stuff still out here. We'll be able to pick it up. You're coming back. 
Yeah, I guess we'll have to cancel that hunt. Let that beast live for now. Okay, close all gates. Get everyone over to here. Let's keep this gate open. That way, Varric can get back. Meant that. There we go. There we go. Alright, come on. Come on, let's stay on top of this. That was not the worst, actually. That was not the worst. We're going to end the alert. Open all the gates. We lost two people, I think. We lost two people. We'll make it work. We'll get those towers back up. At least we know a raid just happened, so we have a little bit more time. But let's give some people some time to rest here. They need to switch to their warmer clothes. They need to eat. They need to rest. We'll leave the hunting for later. I'm going to call it a session here, ladies and gentlemen. We've gotten a little bit over that hour mark just because I wanted to get things sorted. I want to make sure we got all the fields tended to. And I think we're finally caught up here in terms of the resources we need. So that is, as the snow falls, I think a good time to call it. As always, if you'd like to see more Donna Man on the channel, please let me know. Drop a like and a comment down below. It really helps me make decisions for the channel, such as what to continue and what to stop. Apart from that as well, a massive thanks goes out to all of my channel members and patrons for supporting the channel on a monthly basis, keeping us alive and running smoothly. Smooth like the flight of that bird. God, they look so good sometimes. Until next time, thank you all very much for watching. And cheers. <laughs>